you're an entrepreneur. What are the biggest lessons you've learned starting a company? Being an entrepreneur is um, exciting and thrilling. It's also um, challenging and hard. And I think the number one thing that I learned, that I learned in a half of being sort of like a full-time entrepreneur, and I never thought I would say that, um, is really, and this sounds so cliche, but it's so true. I thought I would say that, uh, is to accept the process. I think um, it's all about testing and iterating and trying something and maybe failing or it not turning out how you wanted it to and being willing to try again and not getting so overcome with frustration and sort of um, you know, defeat that you're not able to put your best foot forward again. I tell myself that on an almost daily basis, like Mina, just go with the process. This is part of the process. It's gonna be okay. And I have to say that in my sort of super ambitious, like moving fast, doing, you know, all the education and law firm and all the, you know, sort of formalized training, I've never been present with that in my life where I said to myself, it's gonna be okay. Like this is part of it, it's frustrating. You may need to cry it out, um, but you have to sit with it and accept it and look at every single um, challenge as an opportunity. Um, I know again, that sounds so corny, but I really think it's true. And I'm in a space now where I really see like, wow, that was um, a, a much better way of approaching that. And like, see how less stressed out you are. And not to say that I'm not stressed, um, but really accepting that. So I think in terms of the challenges, that's a really helpful thing is just having that mindset of accepting the growth, accepting the journey and the, and the process. Another is really just, um, I think learning in terms of being an entrepreneur is um, being willing to ask people for help. I think, again, that's something um, as a woman, perhaps, as um, you know, a high achieving person, that you can do everything on your own and I'm gonna do it the best way. But when you're bootstrapping something, when it is a grassroots thing and you sort of don't know when you're gonna, how you're gonna get from A to B, you really have to be willing to um, be resourceful with your, with your peers and with your family and friends. 